With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Well, hello students. Now we are going to see this question. A person climbs up a stalled escalator means standing escalator at 60 seconds. If the standing escalator but same is running with constant velocity. Okay, if standing on a same but escalator is running with constant velocity, he takes 40 seconds. Okay, means if he is standing and the escalator is moving, then he takes 40 seconds. How much will he, the time taken by the person to walk up the moving ex escalator? So how much time will he take to walk up the moving ex escalator? So basically it's given that a person, let's suppose the escalator length, escalator, let's suppose the escalator length is x. Okay, escalator length equals x okay so velocity of man will be equal to x by 60 okay x meters okay so x by 60 and velocity of escalator similarly if we think velocity of escalator will be equal to x by 40 okay x by 40 so velocity of man plus x escalator basically velocity final means when man is also walking and the escalator is also moving will be equal to x by 60 plus x by 40 okay so basically this is basically the velocity so and the time taken we'll just see in a second so what will this be coming over here so it will be the common factor over here will be 120 and it will be basically 6 times 2 so 2x plus 3x which will be equal to 5x by 120 which will be equal to let's leave it like this so that it it will it will be easy in cancelling so we have the final velocity so now time taken will be equal to when basically when escalator and man both move this will be equal to displacement mostly distance by basically velocity which is 5x by 2 firstly let me write the formula distance by speed okay so basically over here also i have used the distance by speed formula so, so you can see length of uh, this is this and time taken was equal to 60 seconds over here and over here time taken was 40 seconds so over here also i have used the same formula so don't get confused over here okay uh, this was the simple uh, speed speed equals basically speed equals distance by time formula okay this was simply that so this will be distance by speed so what will this be coming distance is still x and speed is 5x by 120 okay so what we'll get from here we'll get 120 by 5 so from here we get 24 seconds so what will be the answer basically it will be option number c which is 24 seconds okay thank you so much for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.